I am so happy to be with Chris Skinner here in Chile. He's come to a seminar, Transformación Digital, of the Institute and won. And we're going to ask him some questions. Chris, we're so happy to be with you today. How are you? I'm fantastic. It's great to be here in Santiago. Excellent. First question, you just brought out your latest book, Digital Human. Invite me to read it. What's it about? It's primarily around how technology is transforming planet Earth and specifically how it's transforming the way in which humans relate to each other, trade and transact. And the fact that everyone on planet Earth can now get access to a mobile network and therefore become an entrepreneur is phenomenal. And my best example of that is that there are many billionaires today who were homeless 10 years ago or unemployable. And the fact that technology has given them a platform to trade and transact has made them connect and create new business ventures that are transformational, not just uh, in Europe and America, but actually most of it's coming from the Southern Hemisphere, from here in good. South America. Good. So it's a phenomenal change on Earth. Okay, good, good news. Next question, when you walk into a bank, what are you thinking? What are you looking at? What are you saying, uh-oh? Uh, well, normally my thought is, does the bank have leadership that understands technology? Because everything is moving to a digital structure and digital transformation demands a radical change to the bank structure. It's not just a uh, doing what we do today cheaper and faster with technology, it's doing what we didn't do today in a completely different way with technology. And in many ways that's what I point to when I talk about the Southern Hemisphere and financial inclusion, that what's happening is creating completely new structures of financial trade with technology that's never been contemplated before by a bank. How does a bank deal with that? How do they embrace that? And does the leadership understand that? And many of them don't. Exactly. Okay. And last question. We're trying to teach our students what they need to know to be working in the banking or the financial industry. What would you recommend them to focus on? Well, I think the critical point today is that everything that can be automated will be automated. Software is eating the world. So if you are learning things that are the things that machines can learn, you will not have a job because machines will be able to do that job. So you have to learn the things that machines cannot learn. And that's a lot to do with human relationships, rapport, empathy, emotional connection. And banking, if you think about it, is very emotional because it controls our lives. So if you want to be in banking in the future, you really have to understand the human relationship with money and be able to empathize with that. Excellent. Excellent. Well, this has been Chris Skinner. Thank you so much. We're so happy to have you here and come back soon. Cheers, Celia. <laughs>